Ina naman kami, kaka. Ina naman kami. What's up, everyone? Now here, day two in Nico, and we're here in Toshago Shrine. So this is one of the most famous things or places to do here in Nico. Let's go. That means Toshago Shrine is up there. <laughs> Bento everywhere. Tara. I'm so surprised that there's a new building in here. I thought it's very historical and very old. But there's a new building. It's a new shrine. So this is the Niko Tashago Museum. It's a new shrine. Ah, you know. Where? Where are we going? We're going to the shrine. We're Kenske, kasi ako. Ato chokin. 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 Ato Wow, it is beautiful. This is so beautiful. Bawal mo dehydrate. Tina mo yung bibig mo dehydrated now. Water is life. Welcome to Tashagu. Stairways to heaven. To the jungle. Oh, that tree is very interesting. It has a lot of branches, but on the other side, on just one side. There's no branches on the other side. It's just all on that side. Very interesting. So we're about to go up 200 stone steps. It's okay because it's cold. It's not bad cold, it's refreshing cold. It feels like Baguio, it's a Filipinas. What makes these um, collections of temple beautiful is the idea that it is surrounded by nature. They didn't really renovate it, they just keep it as it is. Even the Edo period. I've been in different temples, Hong Kong, Macau, Thailand, Cambodia. They usually renovate their temples, but in here, it looks amazing though. So in here, you can put your wish over a wooden board. You can also ask for your fortune. Uh, there's a fortune teller there. You can give any coins and then they will give you your fortune in paper. Yeah, those are just a few things you can do here in Nico Shrine. Krishna. So we're now saying bye to this beautiful place, one with the nature. Bye, sayonara. This is their pastry. It has either red bean jam or milk cream inside. It looks like it's fish. Nice. The traditional taiyaki. A few minutes from the Niku Temple or the Niku Toshogun Temple is this false park. Going there, you can take this Akechi Daira Rope. It's a three minute ropeway going to that area. Three minutes walk to the falls. However, it's currently not operational. And if you want to see the ropeway, the cabin looks like that. And it will bring you to the falls there. It looks so beautiful. They said that it's actually beautiful during autumn or fall season because they face a color red. 
<laughs> and down to our last Nico stop is Kagon Falls and Ang kulit nito! Ah, cold! <laughs> and they call this place Kagon National Park or Nico National Park. There's a monitor showing the falls there. Look! Beautiful, icy, icy falls. This is Kagon Falls during winter or deep winter. Oh, okay. Nice. Whoa. So that is the color of the spring. Let's horse kain again. Grabe kain na kain kami. Ina naman kami. Ina naman kami. Hmm. Good morning! This is my 15th day here in Japan and to give you an update, my flight going back to Ireland is currently suspended so yeah, I'll be extended here for two weeks probably. We, didn't, we don't know yet but that's the plan at the moment. I'm gonna be extending my stay here for two weeks so we're doing nothing today. We're just gonna be here at home but then I suddenly felt hungry. Oh lord. Again! and my cousin wants to go around here and she will show me Oyama we're going to eat so yeah come with me let's go so we're looking for a ramen house and she loves gyoza yeah coronavirus here in Japan is um, safe to say that it's well contained but of course we don't want to be very complacent this is for family trip because can be my grandmother's pabang luksa next week. So I cancelled all my, you know, different cities trip like Osaka, Kyoto. Siyempre, ingat ingat din. Feeling ko ang dami na nagagalit sa akin kasi nandito ako sa Japan, ba ikot ikot kasi ako family, but I need to be with them at this crisis. Diba? Diba? Oo. So it's currently 5 p.m. We woke up late. We woke up around 2 to 3 p.m. because we were so tired from our trip to Nico. So we had our well deserved rest. <laughs> so, okay, I've been telling you that I'm here in Oyama and Sade in Oyama. But where is Oyama? Well, Oyama is two hours north from, from Tokyo, but it's not like Tokyo. The coronavirus situation is very stressful around the world. so. I'm just glad that I moved them and for me it's hard because I'm a nurse and I'm not helping but sometimes you just have to do what you gotta do. This is Oyama and this is how it looks like when you go out of the train station. Beautiful isn't it? So we're currently here in Oyama station. Wow nice! Oyama station has a study area as well. Oh that's their cinema. Nice! Oh, that's clinic. Oh, this one is the curry house. Okay, this is where we're gonna eat. Wow, ganda ng view. Nice. So this is an Indian meal. A set of rice, butter curry, and salad with juice. And she said she's only having salad because we ate a lot during Nico trip. <laughs> Don't be hot day. In here you can buy a lot of different things. Like there's a wide range of variety of things that you can buy from here. Cordless power bank. You can definitely buy different things from here. Women electronics, men electronics, house, home entertainment, home appliances, food, clothes. Everything. It's not my go-to place if I'll be living here because there's just a lot of things like there's just <sighs> I'm looking for Kit Kats. <laughs> I'm looking for matcha Kit Kats and desserts, so hopefully we can find them here. 
This is so funny. <laughs> so you can take the air from your nostrils using this product. <laughs> so gross yet funny. <laughs> so the good thing about here, if you show your passport, you can get tax free. So we got 700 yen or 800 yen discount. As long as it's more than 5,000, you can just show your passport and they will remove the tax from it. So if you want to withdraw money from your international card, you can go to 7-Eleven stores and there are a few ATM kiosks there. Welcome. And now we're grocery shopping and I'm stuck in here because I want everything. <laughs> I just want this spooky with almonds and of course Kit Kat, Meiji, a lot of things. Cup noodles for breakfast. So we're here in a bar, here in Oyama. It's a restaurant and a bar, and they serve very good food, they serve very good alcohol, they serve very good cocktail. And what we like about it the most is it's very um, westernized. Because there's a lot of restaurants in here, but there's more like, or like Japanese, of course, they love the culture. But in here, it's more like, you know, uh, universal. So it's a mixture of Japanese restaurant with, of course, you can see Ireland in there, a mini flag in there. And they're playing American show. A world map over here, and if you've been to a different country, if you're a customer here, you can just put a pin around the globe, where you're from, and a lot more. After closing the rest of our of my auntie, we're going here to have some drinks and have some food like this. This is very delicious. One, two, three, go! And drink. So good. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, coffee, I know. Coffee. Coffee. Coffee.